Because it can't just be water out of nowhere. It's drawing water from its vicinity. So my two issues was, if it's tidal, would it be that peaky? And if it's any kind of wave, how could it still leave the water laying around its vicinity and then just be that big as it came by? So there is a type of wave called a solitary wave on water. Uh, that uh, was. Oh, you could uh, tell me you brought wave people together and had that lunch. Is that what you could have told me? No. Uh, <laughs> uh, this particular kind of wave was discovered in the uh, 1700s wow. uh, by, I've forgotten who, a, a, uh, a physicist in, in England who saw a boat that was being pulled by uh, horses and it was just starting up. And it uh, created this wave that traveled down a channel, uh, a canal, uh, and it was peaked like the wave in Interstellar. Though the wave in Interstellar, I have to admit, it was exaggerated. There I don't exa mind exaggeration.